Okay, now for question number five of the sample assessment paper, Pure Maths 2, uh, International A-Level, a company which is making 200 mobile phones each week plans to increase its production. The number of mobile phones produced is to be increased by 20 each week from 200 in week one. So you've got week one, 200, and week two, 220, uh, week three, 240, and so on up to week n where he's going to be producing 600 so we've got to find the value of n so it's an arithmetic uh, series where a the first term is 200 and the common difference d is 20 increasing by 20 each week okay so we want to find the nth term now that uh, we want to find which week they're going to end up with 600 phones being produced in that week not the sum of the phones but the number of phones so any term in a sequence which is arithmetic is given by a plus n minus 1 times d okay so like that's a that's a plus 1d that's a plus 2d a plus 3d up to a plus n minus 1 times d okay so we can say a plus well, we know what these are so we know what a is we know what d is and we know what n is we know what un we know the the, the term we want is n Okay, so we can say A is 200, so 200 plus 20 minus 1 times D is equal to 600. Oops, what am I doing? Why did I say 20 there? No, <laughs> sorry about that. We know that A, which is 200, 200 plus Okay, um, we're going to have n minus 1 times 20 is equal to 600. That's better. Okay, we have to find what that n is. Okay, we have to find what that week is basically. So if we just um, expand that, we're going to have, or what we can do is we can subtract 200. So we have n minus 1 times 20, okay, is equal to 600 minus 200, which is 400. So I'll take away 200 from both sides. And I'm going to divide by 20. So n minus 1 is equal to 400 over 20 they cancel leaving you with 20 so we can say n minus 1 is equal to 20 so therefore n is equal to 21 and there's the answer to part b of this question and now i'm going to go on to part c okay now for part c the company then plans to continue to make 600 mobile phones each week find the total number of phone mobile phones that will be made in the first 52 weeks starting from and including week one Okay, so you got one week one um, up to week twenty one. Okay, um, where you have let me just put a few more from week one to twenty one. So you have one. There's going to be two hundred, and week two there's two twenty. There's week three there's two the forty up to week twenty one where we worked out there's six hundred. Okay, and then from week 22 up to week 52, it's going to be 600, 600 all the time. Okay, so we got to work out, first of all, the sum of the first 21 terms. Okay, so we remember the formula was Sn equals N over 2 times 2A plus N minus 1 times D, which is given in the formula book, and in fact, it's also given in... Um, you know the first part of this question so we know that here n is equal to 21 and a is equal to 200 and d is equal to 20 so we can find the sum of the first 21 weeks which is going to be 21 over 2 times 2 times um, 200 plus n minus 1 which is going to be 21 minus 1 which is 20 times the common difference which is 20 okay so that will give us the sum of the first 21 weeks so we're going to have 21 over 2 okay um bracket we're going to have 400 plus well 400 20 times 20 is 400 as well right okay so we end up with here 8400 so 8400 in the first 21 weeks so there's 8,400 phones being sold in total, okay, in the first 21 weeks. And then you got from week 22 to 52, okay. 
So between week 22 and 52, how many weeks are there? Well, there's 52 minus 22, okay? Okay, and then you have to always add one, all right? There's actually um, 31 weeks there, 31 weeks. 52 minus 22 is 30, plus one is 31 weeks. Okay, so it's very important. Don't think there's 30 weeks there, because for example, if I say week two, three, and four, five, all right, you, you, there's not three weeks. If you do five minus two, you think it's three, but there's actually four, you have to add one. The subtraction gives us the gaps between them, but if you want to find how many terms are actually, between two and five is actually four terms, isn't it? One, two, three, four, you can see that in your eyes, but five minus two gives you three. So, so 52 minus 22 will give us 30, but there's actually 31 terms. 30 gaps, but 31 terms. So it's 31 weeks. So we have 31 weeks in which 600 phones were sold. Okay, so we're now looking at these weeks. There's 31 weeks altogether between there and there. Okay, so the total number of sold from between week 22 up to week 52, including those two weeks, is going to be equal to 31 times 6 hundred okay so 31 6 times 600 is 18,600 36 is 18 plus 600 yes so therefore the total sum okay the total number of phone, so phones sold the total from week 1 up to week 52 is going to be the sum of 8,400 plus 18,000 600 and that's going to give us 26 plus 1 that's 27,000 phones sold and there we have the answer to this question